Claire Baxter from Cinemagic, how are you? Very well, thank you. Cinemagic starts again this month. Yes, we open on the 11th of November and run until the 26th and it's the 20th anniversary of the festival this year. So we've got an even bigger programme this year to celebrate that. What does it cater for? Who does it cater for? Okay, well, City Magic is a film festival for young people. Um, in terms of the age group, really, we run workshops for young people aged 4 to 25. Um, but all of the film programme... Um, that celebrates film for young people is open to all ages. So if you're a fan of, of classic children's cinema, then all of the films are open open to you and there's just an age limit really on the workshop side of things. The people you have had support from is phenomenal. It goes from Dermot O'Leary to Roy Disney, Jim Henson, and it's just remarkable to have something so special in, in Northern Ireland. And I took part in the workshop with Dermot O'Leary in 2005. Since then, you've went from strength to strength. Yes, we're so lucky to have the support of so many industry professionals, as you said. The likes of Dermot O'Leary and Julian Fellows, who's coming back to the festival this year to host a workshop. And local industry professionals as well, you know, local people in, in the film industry here. So we're very lucky to have that support. And really, it's, it's a fantastic way for young people to get involved in the film and television industry, to learn from industry professionals. So it really has developed over the years. And we have um, such, you know, such a lot of support from people in the industry. Industry. And it's a great festival for Belfast as well to have, as it's now like a really, you know, it's a really cultural event on the calendar every year. When you say you get to work with industry professionals, getting to do that from day one is a pretty big experience for people who have literally just started out or maybe just left college. Yeah, well, that's right. For young people aged 16 to 25, if they're really, you know, interested in a career in the film and television industry, then the Talent Lab event um, can cater for that. And it's a great way really to network with other young people who are interested in film and television making and then also you know to share experiences and, and to learn from the industry professionals so it really is a unique opportunity to spend a day or two with somebody working in the, in the field and really to learn from them and, and let them share their experiences with the young people so we, this year we have Lots of, of people coming over. Um, as I said, Julian Fellows is one of those people. The actor Patrick Bergen as well is, is coming to the festival. And we've got other events like film journalism and film production and screenwriting as well. So there's lots really to cater for, for all sort of areas of interest in film and television. People here are in college at the, at the moment and they're, they're looking, you know, perhaps researching in the cinemagic. It's not just about becoming an actor or an actress. You don't just have a talent and away you go onto the silver screen or on in the, the soaps. There is a lot of background work that goes into acting. You know, you've got your production team, your production coordinators, you know, floor managers, and you're going to learn a lot from one of your master classes. That's right. There's a lot of behind the scenes sort of careers in, in the industry as well. So if you're interested in act the actual filmmaking side of things, we would have Q&As and discussions with filmmakers, you know, from all over Ireland as well, who have, you know, made feature films and you can come along as well and, and hear about those, really about their experiences. For example, we're screening four Irish feature films during the festival. One of them is called A Kiss or Jedwood and the producer and the director and two of the stars of that film are coming along to really host the Q&A and take questions from the audience as well, you know, in terms of how the film was made and how to go about getting funding and things like that there. And it's just a way really of, of opening that whole industry up to the general public and to come along. And if you just have an interest in the film itself, it's a great opportunity to come along and find out more, especially about, you know, films that are being made in Ireland and Northern Ireland, which, you know, there are a lot, are a lot of those at the moment. It's not just a film festival as well, because looking at the scope of Cinemagic, you've got the Channel 4 programme making workshop with Neil McCallum. It's over two days in November the 23rd and the 24th. For people who are in programmes, as I said before, they'll be able to take advantage of this, seeing what happens behind the scenes, not just the set of the studio and the presenters. They'll see the cameramen, the crew and everything else. Well, what exactly will happen with the Channel 4 programme workshop? For example, that is going to be a day in which young people can come along and actually, you know, pitch sort of a real life, um, you know, scenario, whether it's a concept for a television programme and, and come along and pitch that really to the program makers and the people from Channel 4. So it's a, an opportunity really to, you know, a practical opportunity and really to find out how, what goes into putting a program together, the do's and don'ts of, of you know, coming up with a, a concept and thinking of your audience and who you should be pitched to and things like that. So 
as you said, it's not just about the presenting side of it or indeed, you know, the filming. It's all of the sort of brainstorming that goes on before a programme is, is put together and made. You've been working for Cinemagic for five years. Have you seen Cinemagic progress year to year and come up with, you know, support from people that you could maybe perhaps only have dreamt of having support with? Well, yes, over, over the last five years it has developed a lot and we're very fortunate to have a lot of industry support, as I mentioned. And there are, you know, Oscar winners attending the festival and it doesn't get much better than that. So to learn from people like Julian Fellow, who has, has won an Oscar, it is just such a great opportunity. And then over the years as well, you know, the festival has developed to include so many educational events for schools as well, things that are being taught in colleges and in the, in the classroom. It, that's sort of complemented with a lot of the workshops that we have on offer. So there really is something for everybody at the festival, whether it's to come along and see, you know, a new independent film that hasn't been released yet or to come along and actually participate in a workshop in film and television discipline. You know, there's such a, a variety on, on offer over the two weeks of the festival.